So, I didn't have any plans on vlogging today, but I thought maybe I could because I wanted to tell you that for the first time, well, the first time I had to drive in Hawaii, it was just for like a few seconds and I was actually following Alan to the destination. It was right up the road from our apartment, so it wasn't that big of a deal. I come with Alan to work today and my father-in-law says, can you do me a favor? I had to go pick something up from Fifi. So... I had to drive far. I was so scared. I'm already scared like driving anywhere, even in Houston. Plus, um, since me and Alan been married, I kind of just go wherever Alan goes, so I'm not actually driving half the time. So, you know, it's kind of like when you don't ride a bike for a while, it kind of, it's hard to get back out. So, I'm not really used to driving that much, and I just had to drive through Hawaii and it was scary these roads are scary and I'm not good with left turns anyway like I know right on red I could do that all day girl but left I'm like can I turn left so I was praying the whole time I'm like Lord you have fully equipped me with the knowledge to do this I was like I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me and I had to drive all the way back to the apartment and all the way back and it was terrifying Sorry, I had to cut the cami off because Alan was coming up to the car. Anyways, it was terrifying. This GPS on the way to the apartment was fine. It took me on back roads. Okay, that wasn't that big of a deal. I was able to kind of like just follow whoever was in front of me whenever they'd be making turns. But on the way here, I guess the GPS chose to give me the faster route. So I had to take highways and stuff and it was scary. Like I don't know these roads. And I'm half blind, like I'm not even wearing my glasses and I'm supposed to wear my glasses to drive. But I can't see these road signs. And I'm so used to like everywhere else, their uh, traffic lights are like right in front of you, you know, on the wires. Here, they're on the sides of you. So you really gotta look like, you have to really pay attention. There, there should be no texting and driving here in Hawaii because uh-uh, girl, confusion overload. So yeah. Oh, maybe this video will be all about ranting and venting about driving in Hawaii. Because I'm already like two minutes or four minutes, I don't know, into this video. Yeah, so that was not fun. It's scary to drive in Hawaii when you're used to, first of all, when you're not even used to driving in a while. But then you're used to how things are in Texas and everywhere else. But Hawaii is a little different. And then they got all these... These road names like Kalakua and Malawalala and Moanalana and Kailani and Kapiolani and and I can't do this. Driving in Hawaii is hard. I could never live here full time. I just my brain my brain just I don't have that kind of brain. I just couldn't do it. So yay, I got to work. I got to work. I got to go to work with Alan again today, which makes me so happy. You guys don't understand because if I stay in the apartment, my choice is to go wherever Fifi goes. And there's nothing wrong with that. But sometimes Fifi, you know, she want to go work out. She want to go do this and that. And I'm like, I don't know. I don't know if I want to go or do I want to stay. But then when you make the choice to stay, then you're stuck in the four walls. So, your only choices is to do something inside those four walls, which I could do. Cook, clean, whatever. Straighten up my room, because I should. But, it's, it's hard. Because you have to have a magnetic key fob to get in the building, to get in the door, to get on the elevator, to go up. And then you have to have another key to get in your room. So, they have two sets of keys. One the guys keep. The other one she has for when she leaves. By the way, Fifi, if you're watching this, I'm not smack talking. I'm just, you know, these are facts, girl. Um, so, yeah, you have to have one of these to get in the garage, the parking garage. You have to have this thing to get elevators in the front door to the pool area, to the bathroom near the pool area. I mean, you have to have this. So... When the guys take it or when Fifi takes it and then I have nothing, I have no choice other than to sit in the apartment. And I'm not a huge fan of sitting too much. I kind of, you know, I'm not like really active, 
but I don't like to just sit somewhere. It makes me go crazy. Unless I'm not feeling good or I'm feeling like being lazy. You know, I get in those moods where I'm like, I don't want to do anything. But, yeah, so I prefer going with Alan because if not, you know, maybe I don't want to work out. Maybe I don't want to go shopping. I'm not big on shopping anyway, girl. Um, ugh, this big truck's right in my face. I ran out of memory or something. My camera just cut off out of nowhere. Anyway, but I still got these emergency lights on. What am I thinking? So yeah, driving in Hawaii is not cool. Going with Alan is cool because, you know, I get to look at my surroundings. I get to sit in the car or I get to sit out with Alan or I get to watch him work, which I like to do. So, yeah. Choices, choices. The things you gotta do, you know? I mean, yeah. Wow, I feel like Fifi is going to watch this and be like, she's talking about me. But I'm not, girl. I'm just saying, like, you know, I have to decide, like, do I want to sit there? Because if I sit there, I know I'm stuck. But if I go, I don't know that I want to go shopping. <laughs> I just, I don't know. I've got to make decisions every day of life, and I'd rather just be with Alan. Because Alan makes my heart beat. Alan is the oxygen in my lungs. Does that even make sense? No, because love doesn't make sense. I don't know if it makes sense. But I do know that I'm still wearing a white t-shirt. Don't worry, y'all. I'm doing my laundry. This ain't dirty white t-shirts, okay? And I'm not going to wear my Sunday's best out while these guys are working. So I got some plain black pants on. I got some tennis shoes on. Some of Alan's socks that don't even fit me. A side braid. I didn't shower today. Ain't nobody got time for that. But I did brush my teeth and splash some water on my face. So I think I'm doing good. I think I'm doing real good. Yeah, what a video. I don't know. But anyway. Hey, whose birthday's coming up? Mine is. Mine is. In 10 days. 10 days, my birthday slash anniversary. 10 days. I'm nervous. I'm excited. I'm scared. Yeah. All of that in once plus more. Mixed emotions. Mixed emotions. All right. I'm going to end this video. Forget vlogging today. I'm just going to post this. It's going to be, you know, venting about driving in Hawaii. It's scary. And I need, I need to bring my glasses because I cannot see the street names. Actually, I'm like, is there even street names? What is this? Wow. I sound really rude, don't I? Sorry. I'm just, I'm just a little southern girl who's used to my little Texas, you know, traffic lights and, and them Texas road signs and stuff. You know? All right. I'll see y'all later. Bye.